Welcome to List It Live, where we give you a guided tour of San Diego's hottest homes for sale. Today we're with Ellen Patterson. Welcome. Thank you. I, I really am excited to see this house that you have listed for sale. Oh, it's beautiful. All right, beautiful show us. Home. So this is the front of the home. If you were to be driving up or walking up before you get to that front area, there's a long driveway. At the end of the driveway are 200-year-old olive trees. Oh, wow. So very beautiful property. And from the front here, there you can see the, the landscaping is very mature, and we'll see some more of that Lush. as we yes, move to the back. The oasis with ping pong table and, and the my clients are actually downsizing to a smaller home that's already furnished, so they're also happy to sell all the furniture, oh, wow. including the ping pong table. You'll see there's a built-in barbecue and the built-in fire pit for roasting s'mores and marshmallows. Below the, on the side of the house there, they put the rock climbing wall in during the pandemic to keep their boys busy <laughs> with physical activities. They also actually put a pickleball court in the driveway wow. that's not there any longer, and this vegetable garden. So they can just, whoever buys the house can just go down and pick out their vegetables and start cooking it in the kitchen, which I believe will be coming up shortly. However, this is the view off the, the balcony on the second level off the primary suite. And there are mountains back there. We just actually, the mountains were beautiful there yesterday. So we just reshot some of the photos to really show everybody how beautiful the mountain views are. This kitchen was renovated a few years ago and they put all top of the line appliances in there. Thermidor, Miele, there's even a growy sparkling water faucet, which I think shows in one of the next pictures. You'll see actually on the other side of that table, there's another refrigerator and freezer drawer in that wet bar, as well as the chilled sparkling water faucet and the liquor cabinet and the wine fridge, which is also really important. And this is the family room that is open to the kitchen and casual dining area. And you'll see that there are the plantation shutters everywhere. There's a lot of natural light mm -hmm. coming into the whole home. Almost all of the five bedrooms have balconies. This is the formal living room near the entrance, and that can also be used as a dining room or a study, as well as, obviously, a formal living room. Yeah. This actually used to be the dining room, but my clients decided that they liked having their dining room table in the whole kitchen open area. So they use this as a sitting room now. And this is upstairs of so the loft space. Those cabinets are built in, so it makes a great study area, home office, or even home theater with the large screen TV. And also in the upstairs are four additional bedrooms. That's the primary bedroom that has the private balcony that we looked at earlier overlooking the mountains. And they just redid this bathroom that's the most recent renovation that they've done. This bathroom and the powder room downstairs with all marble tile and quartz counters, new cabinets and new shower. And it's just a great entertaining home for a big family or you know, lots of people. And there's also a downstairs bedroom as well with a separate entrance. Wow. Oh, a separate en entrance. Yes. That's really neat. Yes, absolutely. I, I love all the little you know, pockets of this home because it seems like they really utilize each space to fulfill a need, a, pur a purpose, you know. It's not just grass, but they've taken the grass and right. made a made a, um, a rock wall for the kids and they've made a garden <laughs> and they have they have that ping pong table and the sitting area. It's like every little pocket, instead of having the dining room, they move that into a sitting room. That makes sense. That's how we live right. now. Right, exactly. Right? And they they revamped it for how their family lived and someone else, whoever buys it next, can Do what they use wish. those spaces to make it most practical for them. And I love the yeah. views of this home too. Yeah. It's really, really, really pretty. Um, are you having open houses on this or private yes. showings? Yes, we are private showings as well as we will be having an open house this Sunday afternoon from 12 p.m. to 3 p.m. Okay. And other than that, if uh, whoever would like to see it can either call or text me at okay. 843-647-9478 in order to schedule a private showing. We just ask that it's at least two hours in advance to give the owners 
good notice. Yeah, of course. And with kids, we all know how what yes, that's like. Yes. This home is listed at 3.15. It's at 413 Hickory Hill Drive in Encinitas. It is a five bedroom, four bathroom, 3769 square feet. Every inch of this house has been thought through to, you know, purposefully live in this beautiful home. If you are looking for this home um, or a home like it, you need to reach out to Ellen. Her phone number is on the screen, but you yes. can also show up to the open house this, this Saturday. This, this Sunday this from Sunday. 12 p.m. to 3 p.m. Also, there's fully owned solar in the home That's to right. keep the SDG&E bills down, Perfect. as well as two car chargers in the three-car garage. Oh, wow. See? Yes. Learn from <laughs> reach out to Ellen. She'll give you more information about this home, but you have to see it. Thank you right. so much, Ellen, for being Thanks. here. Thanks, okay. guys.